shifting is not just a confession transiting from one dimension it is true the bible says the path of the just provided you are just it says the character of your life should be such that you transit from one dimension of glory even to another in the similitude of the rising of the sun unto the perfect day however scripture now says they know not psalms 82 and verse 5 it was a lamentation in the spirit that they know not neither will they understand it says they walk on in darkness and verse 5 says all the foundations of the earth are out of course then verse 6 says i have said ye are gods and all of you are children of the most high but the tragedy is in the next verse it says but you shall die like mere men and fall like one of these princes it takes spiritual illumination light light of the world you step down to my darkness open my eyes let me see that's the miracle in that song will you open my eyes let me see believe i sing it one more time will you open my eyes let me see listen to me listen the bible is filled with limitless possibilities that were demonstrated by the saints and the kingdom life itself is a compendium of infinite possibilities please follow me that our work of faith is only limited by the ability of the one who is called abba the source the sustainer the defender are we together now that the kingdom life please understand this the kingdom life is a compendium of infinite possibilities however that those possibilities are guided and coordinated by an exact body of knowledge there is an exact body of knowledge that is responsible for the various outcomes that we desire and this conference seeks to bring us to a point of quintessence where we stop shadow boxing we do not just randomly apply spiritual principles in hope that one of them will work the bible says he that strives for mastery is not crowned except he strives lawfully so it's a conference that brings us to come up here that we will see better that you know exactly what is responsible for increase you know what is exactly responsible for restoration listen every dimension you require is in christ every dimension your destiny needs is available but do you have the requisite level of spiritual understanding that is tied to that result you know pastor most believers what happens in the body of christ i am not i do not think the body of christ is in ignorance no i do not agree god has helped us in this age and in this time but the challenge is that there is no sequential arrangement of spiritual truth so we do not really know what truth is responsible for what spiritual outcome we engage truth randomly the blood of jesus the fire of the holy ghost prophecy offering seed sacrifice and the danger is that one of them will walk but because there is no exactitude to our spiritual understanding we can no longer reproduce the results is god speaking to us and so we must come to a point where we're not just excited about spiritual knowledge we're excited about exact spiritual knowledge i should be able to know that when i'm learning a revelation i must see its applicability in my spiritual life not every spiritual knowledge is important as far as the victory and the dominion of the saints are concerned just because it is spiritual does not mean it is useful so jesus says i have many things to tell you he says but he cannot bear them he says how be it when he the spirit of truth is come he says he will guide you just because it is truth does not mean it will bless you you must be guided divination uses truth mm -hmm. witchcraft uses truth so you must be guided 
there is an exact body of knowledge you see it is frustrating to know what can be and yet your life never captures that experience i know god can restore but why will it not happen in my life i know god can give speed i cannot doubt it the bible is an attestation of that possibility people recovered lost things an archive of these exploits was captured in hebrews 11. it says time will fail me to talk of gideon jephthah barak men who through faith subdued kingdoms wrought righteousness shut the mouth of lions mm. are we together now yes so that we know what is responsible for what outcome my god that after service someone can know that in the next one month i will take the 10 years i have lost and put it in that one month by a spiritual understanding yes time can be restored in god's economy he says i will restore the years not just the things if all you lose is things you did not lose but when you lose time you really lost so when God begins to restore his focus, because real dominion is dominion over time. Whatever steals your time, stole your destiny. Is God blessing us already? So we thrive on the strength of our depth of spiritual.